Hey guys, my name is Chris. Welcome to Casual Fragrances. Hope you're having a great day. What's your scent of a day or scent of a night? Drop your comment down below. They were talking about new release from the House of Azor. They have a lot of amazing flankers, right? Um, from the beginning to the end now. So this one here is another flanker. This is Azaro Most Wanted. Uh, EDT Intense. So I got my scent from my boy, Jared Miller. So shout out to my boy, Jared Miller. He's a Facebook fragrance group guy that sells a lot of decans for niche indie designer. So I'll leave a link down below to his actual Facebook page. Reach out to him and ask for any kind of fragrances. He probably has it in stock. That's two mils, uh, five mils, and 10 mils available. So I got this 2ml here, I wore it about three days in a row now. So I'm gonna tell you how I feel about it, and how it performs on my skin. I like to buy the bottle, I'll leave links down below. Dealers currently is the only place that sells it. It's $110 for a 3.4 fluid ounces or slash 100 ml bottle. Can buy a discount, I'll leave a link down below. You can get a 50 ml for about 55, up to 77 for a 100 ml bottle. Let's post notes on the screen here. Okay, so I've worn this fragrance three times. I said, this fragrance opens up. Oh man, you're definitely getting a lot of freshness from the bergamot, but this opening is more of a lemon bergamot. It's not very, very bright. It's like a dull type of bright lemon. It's not like super, super bright, but it's nice and calm freshness, which lasts through the life of the fragrance. You're definitely getting a lot of freshness through the fragrance. And then that does calm down some. And in the mid, you're picking up the lavender. The lavender is very beautiful. It's very nice, fresh and clean, maybe slightly soapy-ish, the lavender. So if you don't like lavender fragrances, you're not gonna like this fragrance here. So it's not even worth trying out because lavender is the primary big note in this fragrance here from the mid all the way to the dry down. Now, most Azaros are mainly sweet. This one here has a little bit of sweetness, but this is the most freshest Azaro from the lineup where you can wear this any situation any scenario, any time of the year, or any season, I would say, spray and go fragrance. Now in the dry down, you're still picking up the lavender, getting that fresh, clean, slash soapy feel. You're picking up this little clear note, um, like this liquor note. You get a little bit of a slightly boozy feel in the fragrance. I wouldn't call it a, a super boozy scent, but you get a boozy feel in it. You're definitely getting some oak moss. You're getting this woodiness, green, earthiness feel in the fragrance. But overall, this is a very fresh, lavender bomb fragrance if you don't like no lavender i'm not gonna like this fragrance here i love lavender because i love tom ford uh extreme lavender but it's not the same but you're definitely getting a very dominant beast mode lavender scent on my skin which you'll probably get on your skin as well now be careful because on a test strip it's just mainly lemon when you spread on your skin you're getting that lemon but then eventually that dissipates or goes away you're getting a lot of the lavender and soapy cleanness in this fragrance. Let's touch on the performance. So for me personally, I only want to wear in a fragrance. Projection, it's about half an arm lift. This doesn't project that far. Like it's not a beast mode like the other Azaro fragrances. It's like a sample brownie for the first, I would say, one to two hours. You're going to smell it. Like you're going to smell it throughout the day. But people will probably smell you the first hour to two hours when they're close to you. This does not reach out far or it's not beast mode at all. It's very moderate or a little bit above average. Longevity. I got about eight hours on my skin. Now, some people might get six, seven, or they might get 10 because it's a long lasting fragrance. You're definitely getting this little bit of licorice vibe in the dry down. You're getting some green mossy touches. So it's going to give you a good amount of longevity. I'll just say between six to 10 hours, depending on your skin chemistry. I have no complaints with it. I can still smell it after the eight hours, but it's closer to the skin. Seasons and occasions. So for me personally, this is all year round scent. Just spray and go. You can wear this in the warm months because it's very nice, refreshing, lavender, fresh, soapy quality with a little bit of boozy touches in a dry down. You can wear it in a colder months because it gives you that fresh uplifting with a little bit of citrus lemony opening. It's easy to wear any season, occasion wise, anytime. You can wear it dressed up or dressed down. I feel like it's not really a dressed up fragrance as a statement, but you can wear it if you want to wear it all year round as a signature scent or on special occasions, you can still wear it. Who doesn't want to smell fresh, clean, and soapy, a slight bit of sweetness? And I want to say that there is a ginger touch in this as well. I feel like in the mid and the open is like a sweet ginger vibe as well, which they don't list as a note in this fragrance here. Ratings and final thoughts. So for me personally, I'm going to give this a 7 0.5 out of 10. I really like this fragrance, guys. I would buy it at discounts for around that 50 to 75 dollar mark because it's not bad. It's under 100 bucks. I've spent more money on designers that didn't smell as good as this here for a fraction of more of the price. I guess what I'm saying is if you don't like lavender, fresh, soapy, slightly sweet fragrances, you're not going to like this fragrance here. So I wouldn't even bother sampling it or buying it. But if you're new to Zorro, 
definitely try it out because this is the most easiest Cesaro to wear. The other ones are kind of play flow, flirty. This one here is more of a simple kind of guy wearing a fresh, slightly sweet fragrance. It's not going to reinvent the wheel. It will gain you compliments and you will smell different because you're just wearing something that's fresh, sweet, and soapy at the same time. If you guys have tried the new Wizzaro Most Wanted or The Most Wanted EDT Intense, drop your comment down below. Thank you guys for watching. Hope I see you in my next upload. Peace.